there are a lot of gross romance stories all around the world. Some are classics like Romeo and Juliet, and some are just weird. And this book is another one of those weird romance novels or whatever. It's called The Great Gatsby by F. Scott Bitterland. And, well, hello, fellow bookquesters! It is I, Aaron, the bookquester. Today I have this. I don't understand a book called The Great Gatsby, as I have already mentioned by F. Scott Fitzgerald. So, well, let's get right on to it. So, like, I read the book. It was, uh, it wasn't that hard to read. It was just hard to understand. So, what I, from what I understand, there's a girl named Daisy, and she met a man named Gatsby, but he was super, super poor, so... He disappeared, and Daisy married another man. For and in the span of five, after five years, Gatsby comes back, and he's rich this time. But Daisy seems to still love Gatsby. But Tom, who is Daisy's current husband, obviously doesn't want this to happen because he loves Daisy. Obviously, Daisy's a one to love, actually. And this is all in the perspective of a man named Nick Carraway, who who becomes one of Gatsby's dearest friends, and he is the narrator of the story. He starts from when he first met Gatsby, went to his parties, got to know him, and then got into his love life, and finally to Gatsby's unfortunate death in the end of the book. Now, if I say it like this, I may sound like, Oh, he totally understood the book. No, I did not. That's pretty much all I could get from the book. The basic storyline. And I can't go farther than that. And usually for other books, I can. So, I don't know what this book has that I can't go through. Maybe the romance, but I've read plenty of romance. Don't get me wrong. It was just, I don't know. I couldn't really get the book into my head. After I read it, I was like, what did I just read? And that only happened to me once before, and that was with a pretty hard book when I read The Lord of the Rings when I was in fourth grade. <laughs> it was kind of hard. So, again, I, can, I can't say if this book is good, great, incredible, bad, worse, to try not to read it or something like that, because they don't really understand it. So you guys, the viewers, can help me. Comment down below if you read the book Gatsby, and if you were confused too, like me, or you totally understood it. Maybe it's because of my age, if I get a little bit older I could understand it, but in any way, if you guys help me, or I read the book again and understand it later on, I will definitely have a version 2 of this review, because it's not really much of a review, it's like a call for help and saying what I actually did understand from the book, so that's pretty much it. And like always, your book quester, Aaron the book quester. Please, please help me. I have, uh, yeah, please help me. It's just, I just don't understand it. And I can't rate it or review it properly because I don't understand it properly. 